it is a thing of the past that there used to be one leader and many followers today we need to uh, take everyone along with us including those crushed souls there are sometimes who can adapt to rapid change and who cannot and there are people who uh, have to be laid off people resistance adversarial mindsets crisis pressure yet we need to retain focus uh, and including the one on work life balance how do we bring a responsible leadership including so many things but there is no other option because if we are dealing with a diversity not just in our employees but also in our customers um also in you know how things operate then unless we have a comprehensive perspective it is unlikely that we will be able to deliver against uh, you know the demands of any organization and i don't think leadership is about a how to exercise you know if it was that easy that you go in and you check some boxes and everything will fall in place um that's not it which is why i think leadership has to be harnessed from the time i join an organization as a management trainee you know my as a management trainee my exposure may have to be different you know when we come in we come in as individual contributors then we become responsible for a small group of people then we become responsible for a team then we become responsible for a geography then we could become responsible for a business then we become responsible for an entire company and so on and so forth so each of these are experiences that should add to the dimensionality of leadership and it is incumbent about about the organization to create those pathways for people who are willing to take that mantle of additional leadership responsibility i think it is fine let's say if i were a chef um uh, you know in in a in a uh, restaurant um i would come and tell you don't make me the manager of a restaurant even though it may be a more senior position i love i love the work i do as a chef and that is the reason why when you look at some of these you know restaurants etc etc the chef gets paid a lot more money than the general manager even though in the hierarchy you might find that the general manager is more senior and that is because these are individuals who are doing specialized roles and they don't want to do anything else and i think that's another important uh, factor that we must take into account if you say chef you've done great job as a chef your next promotion is a general manager the chances are that you will end up getting a mediocre general manager and you will end up losing a brilliant chef so leadership is also about using your judgment 